Unfortunately, this story is true. I found someone or something in my attic. In a second, I'll tell you what I did once I saw it. But I want to know if you were me and saw what I saw as a kid, what would you have done? When I was a kid, we lived in an isolated house away from town with thick woods around the neighborhood. Both of my parents worked, so we were frequently home alone. Upstairs, in our most isolated room in the house, we had our bookshelves, a desk, and a small TV. It's where I spent a lot of my time. In the back corner of that room was the entrance to the attic. It was just a square hole in the ceiling. And to get in or out, all you had to do was just lift the little panel. One evening, when I was in that room playing, it caught my attention, and I wanted to see what was up there. I had never seen my parents or anyone else go in there, so I got curious. The room had a really low ceiling. An adult could easily step on the edge of the desk or one of the bookshelves and hoist themselves right in or out, but I wasn't tall enough for that. I pulled the chair over, I pushed the panel up, and climbed into the attic. It took me a minute to get my arms into a position where I could pull myself up, but I got it figured out and got my upper body into the attic to look around. It was hot. The air was uncomfortable to breathe and it was dead quiet. Just the sounds of the house creaking, the wind breathing against the roof. It was also really dark. Small amounts of light shone through the vents, as well as what little light I brought with me through the entrance. There wasn't much room to walk around up there or store boxes or anything. As far as you could see, in any direction, were just the support beams that made up the frame of the house and tufts of insulation that jutted out between them. In fact, it was totally empty. Except at the back. Blackness. I could hardly see anything. Mostly. One of the shapes in the dark didn't make sense. There was something at the far end of the attic that was too thick to be a beam and too tall to be a box. In fact, it looked more like a person trying to hide behind the support beams. I hadn't been scared when I first set out to do this. It felt more like an adventure. I was scared now. I just froze, holding myself up in that opening and staring, letting my eyes slowly adjust to the dark, telling myself that surely, once I could see it, it would be some clothes or something hanging there. No reason to be scared at all. And then it leaned. What would you have done? Pause and comment below what you think you would have done and what you think I did. I didn't investigate. There was no way I was getting any closer to that thing. I didn't call the police either. That might have been smart, but it didn't even occur to me. I didn't even tell my parents. I did nothing. Like a kid pulling the blanket over their head at night, I did my best to pretend it never happened. I didn't look at it, I didn't go back up there, and I didn't say anything. Things sometimes went missing from my house, and I started leaving things leaning against my bedroom door so they'd make a noise if someone tried to open it quietly. I convinced myself it was in my head though, and that he never came down from there. 